Hey guys, this is our video on um, our pox, and so, um, yeah, we're going to be making a video on some pox. Here they are. Come on, Rylan. Um, the pox are the normal green biscuit, the green biscuit snipe. And Ugh. I don't know. That's and called. Does I it have a name nobody on it? knows what this like, one's called. It? I'm I don't know. But these but are yeah. called green biscuits. Green, so. You're not in the video. Um. So yeah, we're gonna be reviewing them, and also we are going to be. Um. Oh, it says it says it's called the super puck. Oh, okay. So it's called the super puck. Oh, Rylan, one of the pucks just fell down there. Can you grab that, please? Um, this puck. So. This one's beat up quite badly, yeah. right there, as you can see, mm -hmm. both sides. Um, it's been, um, if you can I'm, tell, I'm pretty sure this, there's like a piece of foam in between there. There is foam this one in between. You so. can see that. And you see these have two holes, so. You can see right there. You can see this. They rust, the and little screws rust this a lot, one, as you can see, if you leave it outside. Yeah, if you leave it outside in the water, They'll um, rust they them. will, yeah. Yes. And, uh, Grady, you're not in the video. And these have little stud, white studs yeah. that sit on the outside, mm -hmm. which make it roll really well. It actually, I find it actually rolls this a lot better. This is probably better. the best one here for stick handling. Yeah. Yeah, and this one's the best for sniping and Like, stuff not like very that. raising it high, but, like, fast snipes. I'll yeah, fast it. snipes and for, like, really this great... This one's, like, for, for getting top cheese and all that. Yeah. Um, the, this one... Um, is good for working on your accuracy and Here's get and and also me. working on the um well, also working on oh uh, what's it called also working on saucer passing if you don't know what that is it spins in the air like flat like this really well to the other person so yeah um. As you can tell, um, my friend Ryland here told you that this one is the best for stick handling. This one is the best for raising. getting top shelf and raising and saucer passing. And this one's the best for working on your accuracy and power no, and stuff. this one might be the best for saucer passing. Yeah, and it's also really good for saucer it passing has, too. This one probably has the most realistic weight of a puck. Yeah. The um, weight is really... Deceiving, so yeah. Um, I also find this is actually a little heavier, uh, just a little bit heavier than an actual pot. Is this the screws in here add a little bit more ounces to the weight? Yeah, the um, if you don't know the screws, where they're me, pretty I'll large. Show you. These screws actually add more weight if you can focus. What are we doing in the next video? Just well, focus, but if you can see that, it's not rusted, which is a cool. So, um, we are going to go downstairs and get our shoes on and stuff, and we will be right back, and we will um, be shooting all these. For a part two of the puck review. Yeah, yeah part so two. So, yeah. 